Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to continue to look at the new Spectral Suite designed by Christian Vogel at Never Engine Labs. Here now, we're going to take a listen to the Cross Mags example where the spectral magnitude envelope of one sound is crossed with another. I'm also going to change some other parameters on the fly in a real-time performance. I hope you enjoy this one. Let's check it out. Here we are back inside the suite, this time looking at the Spectral Suite in real-time, the stereo version with the cross input enabled, and then I've appended Hong Kong Lockhart Intersections, which is a field recording I'll play you in a moment. So that cross input is this sound here and it's enabled under the build options input cross set to true. So it's also this sound is this sound and that's going to take the spectral magnitude envelope and cross it with the source which our source remember is the piano sample and the drum loop. I'm just going to use the drum loop for this example. Inside the sample I've replaced the sample with one of my own, a field recording from the streets of Hong Kong, and I've enabled the anti-alias filters, which will help with some of the artifacts when scaling the rate of playback. And just so you can hear a bit what we're working with, this is a bit of the field recording. Okay, so as you can hear, that's pretty noisy. So we'll see if we can hear some of that come through along with some of those voices and other interesting sounds uh, when we play this. So let's go ahead and check it out.
Okay, so there you have it. A little bit of a glimpse at the spectral suite with the cross spectral magnitude envelope enabled. Again, using noise in a street recording from Hong Kong. By no means exhaustive, but does give you a bit of a glimpse of what it could sound like. Hope you enjoyed that and hope that was useful for you. Again, this is the new spectral suite design and program by Christian Vogel at Never Engine Labs. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.